Dad, it seems like it's been a, a good opportunity for you this spring, obviously, with, with yeah. Jalen and, and Don both in those red jerseys. Just what, what have you kind of, how have you felt this spring has gone for you, and have you kind of looked at it as like a good opportunity to get more and more reps? Yeah, I mean, so I, I look at it as a take advantage of it and like get, get a coach's my first impression. So, yeah. Has the um, coaching change kind of like reinvigorated you a little bit? I know last year it didn't go the way you would have wanted it to. Did the fresh start positively impact you? I mean, yeah. Um, I love our new coaching staff this year, and it's been it's been good for me In so far. Ways, you know, talk about that a little bit. I mean, better, more opportunities on the field, things like that. It's just different. You, you finished pretty strong last year. A couple, of, I think it was the Virginia Tech game where they gave it to you like eight times in a row to end the game. Just yeah. finishing strong to last season, you feel like that kind of gave you like yeah. momentum, excitement going yeah. into the offseason? It definitely did. It gave me more more confidence. And so just came, just come out here this spring and gave it all I got. So. In regards to strength and conditioning, uh, how do you feel about your body coming into this season compared to last year as a freshman? Um, shoot, it's good. I mean, I dropped some weight. I feel my body changed a lot. I feel lighter, so, yeah. In high school, uh, we interviewed, you talked a lot about basketball. You, you were big on basketball. You, yeah. you see the UM team go to the Elite Eight. You think you had enough skills to get out there and play with them boys? <laughs> I mean, I, I haven't played in a minute, so <laughs> I don't know. You you had some rebounds. <laughs> you think you can still rebound? Yeah, yeah I had a couple. Yeah, you had a couple. Hey, Dan, I would, two, two things. One. How would you describe your running style, and you know, and your you know, how you'll be used in the game? And the other thing I want to ask you is, we're getting Wesley today, the same. What you know, what you see out of him? Um, well, uh, my running style is, I mean, everyone look at it as punish people, but I feel like I'm more than just uh, just a punish back. And Wesley, he's a, he's, I'm glad we got him because he's a good part of our linebacker core, and he helps a lot. Tackle for sure. Tackle. Just hard hitter. Or? Yeah. You, you mentioned you, you dropped some weight. Did, like, are you actually lighter? Like, have you lost extra yeah. pounds? Like, what are, what are you down to now? Uh, right, now, like, two thirty-eight. Okay. Yeah. Was that? I mean, you came in. You didn't get the early enroll thing last year. Yeah. So like, was that? You know, it's you're come in and you're thrown right into the fire, right? Was it like good to get the off season to like yeah. actually to, change things? To drop some weight. Yeah. Uh -huh. Uh, what would you like to be at for the season? What do you think would be a good weight for you to run at? Uh, around 225, 230. And, you know, the running back room is full of South Florida guys. You, Jalen, Don Chaney, Henry, all, you know, Dade or Broward. Do you guys ever kind of talk about those high school days and kind of reminisce on that stuff? Uh, yeah, me and Rooster argue all the time about <laughs> <laughs> how they beat us uh, when I was in high school. Uh, can, you talk, can you talk a little bit more about your basketball background and how it's kind of helped you throughout your football career? Um, I mean, footwork, basketball helped me with my footwork.